Well, filming is now in full swing for the Disney movie Safety, about the life of former Clemson football player Ray Ray McElroth Bay, who suited up for the Tigers back in 2006. And crews have been on campus filming at iconic Tiger Town locations. Fox Carolina's Matt Koufax here in studio with us. I know a lot of folks interested on where they'll be filming. They maybe want to get that extra part. Absolutely, Cody Tory, and it's only going to ramp up as the week goes up, uh, as the week goes on, I should say. Today, we got to hear from both the producer of the film, Mark Charty, and Coach Sweeney himself. Both men talked about Ray's incredible story. Coach Sweeney was actually an assistant when McElroy Bay was on the team. They both say when crews film live at halftime of the Saturday's game, they want fans to be all in. Now, for the past couple days, crews have been doing most of their work filming at iconic locations like the Carillon Garden, the Cooper Library, and the Reflection Pond. They tell me they've already used hundreds of students as extras. Ray McElroy Bay is famous for adopting his 11-year-old brother, Famar, just night at just 19 years of age when he was playing for Clemson. The movie will follow his decision to take his brother out of their family's broken home and examine the effect it had on his life and the lives of those around him. And both Coach Sweeney and Charty talked about what makes Ray and the project so special this afternoon. Ray Ray uh, stepped up and, uh, you know, brought his brother in. And, uh, you know, it created uh, some interesting dynamics, obviously. Small stories sometimes resonate the most because it's just him getting out on that field and being able to, you know, be a part of the school and having his brother there and all the people that have supported him. That's what's going to make people clap and cry at the end of this film. Of the Charlotte game on Saturday at halftime, crews plan to start out at Howard Rock to film their actors running down onto the field, just like the players do in real life. Then they'll film two defensive plays and end on a kickoff all in seven minutes. It's really going to come together. They want fans to stick around in their seats to keep that atmosphere electric. And also happening this Friday, the crew will be shooting some important training scenes at the Jervy Gym, a place Ray says he remembers doing a lot of training. He's actually a consultant role for training those actors on the film set. And we will be there as they roll the cameras to bring you an interview with Ray himself and talk about the project that the producers say has now been 12 years in the making. Cody Torrey, back to you.